hello friends so welcome back so in this video i'm going to show you that how we can deploy maintenance window to a collection so what we can achieve with this uh, we can install update and software that will not impact our user productivity so example you can take an example that maximum user or your management complaining that our system rebooting uh, during our working hours uh, where we don't have option to restart the or stop the computer so we are um, so system restart automatically so they request IT team or they can escalate this matter to their uh, management that uh, we don't want this kind of deployment during the business hours so then IT need to decide that they can schedule a maintenance windows for windows and security update uh, after office hour or maybe on weekend so in this video I'm going to show you that how we can create that collection so first first we need to log on to our SCCM server okay start system center configuration manager the first step we need to create a device collection so asset and compliance from workspace area device collection right click create device collection name it So select, click on browse. All system. Okay. Okay. Next, add rule, direct rule. Next, system resources, name, and we need to add value or percentage. Click next select the device which we want to add this maintenance window so select windows uh, 10 only if you want you can add multiple click next next and close so click next again next and close so now we have this uh, maintenance window so just right click on this window choose properties uh, maintenance window click on add so name it whatever you want so effective date you can uh, select the date and then start time and you can mention the end time duration you can mention three hours or is totally it will automatically pick up from your start or end time okay so resource panel if you want you can make more changes as per your schedule you can select Friday Sunday Saturday Monday as per your or record, uh, record every one day or you can ma make changes as per your requirement so from apply this you can select all the deployment software task you don't need to select the other thing you just need to click on all deployment and then click ok then apply then ok so that's it if you want you can open a cm trace and open the required log file so guys thanks for watching this video have a nice day bye bye